Welcome to the Web Design Help Series for the XAR Web Designer software, where I answer questions for viewers or subscribers to the XAR template channel. In this particular case, I'm going to be answering a question about how to create a mouse over button where when you click on the mouse over state, it will bring in an object from the side of the screen. So let's go ahead and do that. First off, most of you should already be familiar with how to create a mouse over button, so I'm not going to really explain that part. I'm only going to explain the part of how to bring in the object from the side of the screen. So first I'm going to go ahead and create my mouse over button. So now we have our mouse over button. The next thing that you want to do is in your page and layer gallery click on the new layer button and we're going to create a layer and call it maybe uh, object. Okay? And on that layer make sure you have it selected and the way you know that is you have the blue highlight behind it. And let's go ahead and create an object in our workspace. In this case, I'm just going to draw a rectangle and I'm going to change the color maybe to a dark gray. Okay, and now we have an object in our workspace. The next thing that you want to do is click on the button that we created, right click on it, go to Web Properties. And under Web Properties, make sure you're under the Link tab. And under that tab, we're going to click on the pop up layer option. And in the drop-down menu, we want to select the text object. And that's basically selecting the layer that we created in the page and layer gallery called object. And that's the layer that that object is going to come in on, okay? In this case, the, you know, dark gray rectangle that we created. So let's go ahead and click on settings. And then under the transition effect, we're going to change that to slide in from right. Once you have that set and you have the speed set as well for what you want it to be, let's go ahead and hit the OK key and then hit OK here and then hit F5 to preview it and if we place our cursor over this button you see that it highlights it to green and if we left click on that you see that the object slides in from the right so that is how you create a mouse over button that makes an object slide in from the right when you click on it if you click in any blank space in your website the object will disappear okay and there's different settings you can change for that but you know the purpose of this tutorial was to show you how to make an object slide in from the right with the mouse over button. So if you found this video to be helpful, don't forget to embed, comment, share, and subscribe, and stay tuned for future videos.